This is Cooking in Brooklyn with Danny Milano, and I'm Danny Milano, and today we're making Chicken Sorrentino. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to the Bridgeside Network, and if you're on YouTube, make sure you hit that bell notification. Now let's get it on! Hey, go Bridgeside. So you're gonna see Chicken Sorrentino on a lot of different menus in the restaurants. People make them various different ways. This is the way I like to make it. You definitely need some chicken, you definitely need some eggplant, and you definitely need mozzarella. I like to add some prosciutto, and we're gonna make it with a sherry wine butter reduction. So we're gonna start off by heating up our cooking oil. In the meantime, we're gonna prep our eggplant. We're gonna slice it up. Now, this is an eggplant. To the sick-minded generation, you may know this as a certain type of emoji. This is a vegetable, so let's slice it up. We're gonna cut off our tip, mazel tov, and then we're gonna cut this baby long ways. Hey, Dan, is that from the back of the yard? Dave, it's still cold outside. We're not growing vegetables yet. All right, so our eggplant is sliced. We're gonna put it on the side for now. We're gonna move our flour over here. Then we're gonna grab our chicken. We're gonna flour it up, and we're gonna place it gently right into the oil. All right, so we're gonna let this sit on each side for about a minute and a half, just until the chicken gets nice and golden. Again, you don't have to cook the chicken fully through, because it's still gotta cook in our wine reduction. All right, so let's grab this chicken. Are you sure you wanna place it that close to me? Is it safe, Dave? Can we trust you here? I don't know, man. It's a gamble. Then you won't eat. So we're going to grab our egg, which is already cracked and beaten. We're going to take our eggplant, flour it, again, on both sides, and then we're going to throw it right into the oil. How long do you cook the eggplant for? The eggplant we're going to cook for maybe four or five minutes. Hey, Dan, is this dish from Sorrento? Is that where they get Sorrentino from? Like a, a style of uh, the way of cooking it? This is actually an American-Italian dish, but it's a good question because Sorrento's also famous for the gnocchi Sorrentina pasta dish, which I did cook here before, and that involves eggplant. So that, that may be where they got the name from. All right, so our eggplant's done frying. Make a little room for the eggplant here. So let's move this pan over here. So I got some chicken broth that I heated up over here. We're actually gonna add this into the dish later on. Let's get our butter over here, and we're gonna add a little bit of the flour. Now we're gonna grab some sherry wine. If you don't wanna use sherry wine, you can use any other sweet wines, like a marsala wine, for instance. And we're gonna throw this right into the pan. Now we're gonna grab our chicken, and we're gonna place our chicken in first. Get our chicken broth that we were talking about earlier on, and I'm gonna add two and a half ladles. And we're gonna grab our prosciutto. We're gonna layer it right on top of the chicken. Let that sit there for a second. So I'm gonna cut this eggplant in half. And we're gonna layer it right on top of the chicken and the prosciutto. So while this was all cooking, I had my oven preheated to 375. I got a baking tray here. And I'm gonna take this chicken, place it right onto the baking tray. We're gonna layer the mozzarella right on top of the eggplant. And then we're gonna throw the chicken right into the oven. You only gotta leave the chicken in the oven until the mozzarella melts. Once the mozzarella melts, we're ready to go. This oven plays no games. It's like a Superman oven. The mozzarella is already melted, and we're gonna throw this chicken back into the sauce for just about a minute and a half. This looks great, by the way. I don't wanna toot my own horn. <laughs> All right, so we're ready here. Let's shut this off, and let's dish it out. Ooh. It's all about the presentation. I'm gonna pour this sauce right on top. Chicken Sorrentino. Dave, bon appetito, my friend. Thank you very much. Mm. This sauce is perfect. It's a great pairing. You have the chicken, the mozzarella, and the saltiness from the prosciutto. This is excellent. How about the eggplant? Oh, how could you forget about the eggplant? Try this dish at home. Let us know how it comes out. Take some photos. We love to see photos. But don't be disappointed, because it's never going to come out like Danny Milano's. Go Bridgeside. Thank you again for watching. Don't forget, please like and subscribe to the Bridgeside Network, and do not miss it. Join us next time. We're going to make Oraquieta with broccoli rabe and sausage.